right. Morning, morning. Let's see here, put some light on it. Happy New Year's. Feliz Año Nuevo. For all of those that survived and made it through 2021, welcome to 2022. Hope everyone had a safe New Year's Eve. Made it through, unscratched, unscathed. I know it's been a very difficult, hard year for a lot of people. Lost family members. Coming and going. It's illness, everything going on. You gotta stay strong and stay to your faith. First boat out here in the morning. Try my luck, it's definitely a warm, very warm December or January 1st. Uh, it's supposed to have a cold front tonight or tomorrow. So I figured I'd try and get out here today. I invited a couple of my buddies, but they obviously wanted to sleep in like the rest of the world. But like me, I'd rather go fishing. Okay. So water temperature is right at 70 degrees. 6.30, I'm gonna head out to my number one spot and see how we do this, all right? Good luck, tight lines, God bless. Happy New Year's, people. Alrighty, righty. Anchored up. We get some baits out. Let's go from there. All right. Rods are out. I just heard something hit. Can't tell which one it was. like a snack now. Yeah, hit let go. Alrighty. Well, we're going from here. Got all my lines out. Already had our first hit. I could hear the drag rip. Yeah, I tore it up. Put it back out, see how we do. Like I said again, I hope everyone had a blessed, blessed, blessed Happy New Year's, everyone made it home safe, trouble free. Make sure everyone is in one piece. Out here for the love of fish. And I can hear the fish jumping around me in the water. You know, a lot of you are probably mucking your hangovers, but uh, again, always very blessed to be out here. Thankful for y'all, my, my viewers, my family, my friends, and all the opportunities I get to come out here and fish and do the things I love to do. Alrighty? Well, check in here in a second to see if I got anything else going on. Take care. Alright, just had one hit. Let's see here. Yep, fish on. It's not even... Just after 7, 7.02. Second hit. First one hooked. Ain't gonna be a keeper though. Alright, All right, no skunks. There we go, people. I look like I just had a hit on the front of the boat. There we go. Let me measure them real quick. Uh, let's 
16 and a half. Not a bad catch. Oh, front rods are hitting. Give me a second. See here. Oh shoot. Where's he going? He's all the way to the back of the boat. Oh dang. Tied around. Hold on. What the heck? Take lots of lines on me somehow. Well, I haven't, but I got a catfish. Oh, shoot. Got another one hitting over here. <laughs> what a way to start the morning. Two nice hits. Three nice hits. Nice channel cat here. There we go, people. Nice channel. There we go. Throw him back. All right. All right, just had a hit on this rod. And some technical difficulties that catfish. Oh, what the hell? Oh, I hit it and quit it. Okay. No problem. That's the way it goes. I keep checking. All right, drag dripping. Ah, oh, shoot. Hold on. Damn it. Drag is ripping. Oh, Lord. Good morning. Hold on. Technical difficulties. You can hear it. It's ripping. Find out. That's a cute little red. There we go. Yeah, baby. On point, on the money. Let's see. Still recording? Yep, still recording. Okay, on the money. Got a first keeper red. What do I do with it? Fish grips. Fish grips. Settle down, people. Settle down. This is a nice one. 
perfectly hooked right through the bottom of the mouth. There we go. Look at that, people. Yeah. Let's measure them. Measure this bad boy. Twenty-six and a half. Haha. -ha. Again. There we go, people. Blessed. On to the next one. On this right here. Let's see what's going on this right here, because it's not where I casted it and the line's real tight. It's got a fish on it. Yeah, he's, you can tell he's hooked himself around something. There we go. Nice rat, not a keeper, but there we go, people. Look at that, beautiful. Three spots. One, two, three. Beautiful. Let's see. Just, just for safe sake. Seventeen. All right, God bless. All right. Fourth good hit. Good hits this morning. Really good hits. They're all yanking the drag. Get me all excited. There we go. I said, another beautiful little ray. He's going to be right about 18. Yep, right at 18. Take care. All right. Just putting another rod back in the water. Nice mid mid range. Uh, 
rats. Right about 17, 18, 19 inches. Another, another nice hit. Yeah, it's been very busy. It's already, it's only 7.25. Fourth or fifth hit I've already had. Talk about a great way to start the new year. Look at that. Let's see. There we go, people. Let's measure them real quick. 18. Second 18 in a row. Take care. Alrighty, people. Again, got to keep her on the boat. Nice 26, 27 inch red. Already had five really good hits. I just missed one over here. I hit. I, I picked up the rod too soon. It pulled and I didn't set the hook. But as we know on my boat, every time we get a good keeper, it's beer 30, celebrating the brand new year. January 1st, 2022. Here's a cheers to all of you. Cheers to all my fishermen friends, all my family, friends. Hopefully for a better year than we've had the last two. All right, cheers. Favor of the day, traditional old PBR. A little to the lake gods. Always share with the lake gods. I said, y'all take care. Tight lines. Fish on, people. All right. Let's see what we got here. Oh, I love that sound. Love that sound. Follow the fish. Follow the fish. Don't move back. We go hit the surface. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Come on up, baby. Come on up. Definitely doesn't want to come in. Oh, I heard something else. Ah, it was a 
optimized pit. hooked in the side of the mouth oh he's got some battle damage wow weird funny mouth that's how we do it baby yeah make sure I'm still recording yeah 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 beautiful look at his mouth Looks like somebody chopped his mouth off and threw him back or something or he got off of something. Beautiful. He's drumming, he's talking. Pleasure him real quick. Oh yeah, 27 and a quarter. There we go, people. For the love of everything. Beautiful. Beautiful fish. Look at that. Yeah. Take care. All right, people. I'm going to talk to y'all while I'm tying a new knot. Typically what I use out here, Carolina rigs on most of mine with the, the half ounce quarter ounce weight I make all my own Carolina rigs start saving me money after spending buttloads of money on all those Eagle Claw ones after a while they get all kinked because of steel so I start making my own with a 80 pound test they tend to last a lot longer I use number four number five circle hooks HEB head on shrimp I got a Santee rig out I got a, well, I ha yeah, I got a Sandy rig out. I also use a free line. Different options. Try to catch all kinds of different fish. Well, at least the, the three major fish that are out here. Reds, cats, blues and channels. I have yet to catch a gar. I have caught a big old, big old, huge soft shell turtle. Uh... My personal best so far is a 36 inch red same with my son, 34 pound or 34 inch blue. And I just caught another personal best the other day, 30 half, 31 inch blue through hit back. So love my love for fishing. Love for fishing. I love bringing my family and friends out here to enjoy catching, put them on the water. Not everyone gets a chance to have a boat, get out here at the lake. If you ever get a chance though, learn how to fish. It's relaxing, it's fun, exciting, peaceful, sometimes a little stressful. But overall, it's a great family tradition to pass on. Great thing to do on your off time. Big old fish just jumped out of the water over there. But y'all have any questions, comments? Please add comments in the comment section. Ask questions, I'll try to answer them as good as I can. I follow three of the best guides out here, asking for tips, pointers. They've all, they've, all three of them have helped me. Melo Palacios with OCD Fishing, David Ortega with Second Chance Fishing, and TJ Whitworth with TJ's Fishing Guide Service. Those three guys out there are probably the best out here on this lake. They hit this lake, they hit Browning, they also hit the Frio River for the white bass, which will be coming up this week, next week. So hit them up, I'll put links in the description at the end of the video and uh, in the description block of the video, okay? Give them a call, hit them up, support their business. Always support local business if you can. Stay safe, follow your heart and do what you love. Peace out. All right, had her hit. Oh, shoot.
Other rods going off. Real pretty. Woo. Let's find out what we got going on over here. Oh, shoot. Oh, this is going to be a catfish, I bet. Oh, I got another rod going off in the back. <laughs> Triple. Oh, yeah. Nice big channel. That's a big channel. Holy cow. That's a real big channel, cat. Find out what's going on on this back rod now. Still recording, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. This might be my third keeper red right here. That is a monster channel cat over there. Oh. What a way to end this if this is a keeper. A triple hit. Oh yeah. Nice red. Today was a definitely a great day. Ooh. Talk about barely hooked. Right through the skin in the mouth, just barely hooked. Look at that. Nice people. Look at that. way to finish the morning and it's 8 30. 27. Now just to show you follow me make sure we're still recording. Yep. Okay. There's the red. Check out this fat channel. Oh, you stink, guy. Ah, <laughs> that made for a hell of a triple. First one was a throwback. Look at that. He's just as long. 27 inch channel. Nice. Let me weigh this guy because he's heavy. All three keeper reds 
Right at 27. Let's see here. And for those who are wondering, because of my last video, my scale broke, got me a new scale. Got me a new few things. Got me a new scale, a new self, self char, uh, uh, battery operated uh, Bubba fillet knife. Pounds. Seven and a half pounds, 27 inch channel cat. Look at that bad boy. Yeah. To keep or not to keep. I know that they're starting to become full of eggs. So we'll go ahead and throw him back. I don't want to take a chance of ruining some spawning there we go all right three and done people again real thankful to those who have helped me learn especially my grandfather who taught me the love of fishing god rest his soul uh other friends that i have that we enjoy the love of fishing tim farrow steve pena bill orman my brothers and of course, my, my buddies that I've made out here, Nola Palacio, OCD Fishing, David Ortega, Second Chance Fishing, DJ World War Teacher's Fishing Guide. If you want to catch great fish, get with those three guides. Got the links in the back at the end of the description. Again, God bless. Everything is good. What a way to start off the new year on New Year's Day. Three badass keeper reds. Nice badass keeper channel. That's the second channel I caught today. Y'all take care. Hope you enjoy the video. Take care. Alright people, what an awesome day, awesome way to start the new year, good catches, three nice, really nice uh, 26, 27 inch red keepers, really nice 27 inch, seven and a half pound uh, channel cat that I threw back, had some good uh, rat reds, all 17, 18 inches threw them back, no complaints today, definitely a blessed day, Let's see a few people getting a late start out here in the lake. I was out here early, ready for gets warm. I said, always very blessed. Another year gone by. A lot happening this year, but I'm very thankful for my family, my mom, my dad, my wife, my son, my brother, all my friends, my daughter, my grandsons, my son-in-law. Everyone in my family, I'm very blessed to have. I appreciate everyone in your family. Love those who love you back. Try to do your best in life to improve every situation you're in. And especially, if anything else, be thankful, be very thankful, and take care of your health. Without your health, you ain't gonna have anything. You won't be able to enjoy anything. So please take care of your health, y'all. Again, another great, successful morning on the lake. Y'all take care, God bless.